Hey, do, do, do. Are we ready, Daddy? I think we're ready. Gary Berry. Wait, I'm <laughs> Gary Bear. Are okay. you stumbling upon something? Dude, have. it is blue as shit. Why are you so sad, Jay? <laughs> blue ain't your color. I'm blue. blue. I would suck off ten guys. Come on. I'm blue. I'm a suck off ten guys. I'm a suck off ten guys. Oh, that hits different. We're on 60 here. Uh, 60. 6 0. How old I feel right now. Oh, yeah. You're sicky poo, huh? Yeah, I'm a little sicky poo. How'd that happen, dude? Um, one of the people at the uh, wedding I was on and lived, was staying in a house with my aunt was sick all week. Jesus Christ. Yeah. So redo my COVID. Sis, my sister got sick too. Patient zero. It doesn't feel like COVID. It's oh. a very light head. It looks like COVID. Yeah. It looks, <laughs> it looks like cancer. Yeah. <laughs> it looks like post chemo. Yeah, um, so Garrett's in chemo I'm in for the I'm 30th chemo. year. <laughs> I'm, I'm not 30. Uh, Don't. For the 21st year. For the ninth it's the 30th time. round. Yeah. 30th round. Couple the ninth double year of years. 21. Yep. Speaking um, of age, you're old. I'm you, the youngest of all three. You no, look why would old. you do that? I'm, he looks older. I'm younger than all of you. You look older than all dick. of us combined. Why, why did you even do that? I'm huh? currently a year younger you just, than both You body bagged us on on. So many levels. There. Yeah, we're you're, older you're than you're him. both twenty nine, and he looks like a children. I'm eight. No, he's in chemo. <laughs> Child dude. of the corn. I I am you younger, are. and I look younger than both. You look like you only eat fucking corn. Mm-hmm. Yeah, well, you look like you look like he looks like he eats corn meal. Sounds yeah. like a healthy diet. <laughs> <laughs> That's what the uh, ancient Indians used to survive off. So, but um, Jay, you need to. You can't just show up with the ski mask. Why not? <laughs> <laughs> you can't show up to work in a ski mask this is hr he just got back from a target <laughs> what are you talking about yeah i just got done he just got done grocery shopping <laughs> yeah, <she> got... <laughs> walmart was uh, lit i love how all your my te- boys you, are in like the, you can't help but have buck teeth with that thing on it's incredible oh yeah that fucking the little chipmunk teeth are incredible that guy's fucking out there isn't he yeah he looked like kodak black <laughs> in that one interview yeah. I love it. I hope so. These, I hope these so. clips will be. <laughs> <laughs> these clips so. are gonna be gold. It's just gonna be like two normal dudes. <laughs> Dude, to you. Oh, oh. Up. I will say this up. has a limited life on it because it's yeah. hotter than all shit. Yeah, it yeah. heated up really fucking quick. We turned that air off. It dropped ten degrees almost instantly. Yeah, and it was barely. Doing it dropped anything. ten degrees. It, it got colder. colder. Yeah. It's, yeah. Got colder. it's actually colder. It dropped and it went. Yeah. in a it worse feels direction. hotter, but it's way colder. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Last episode before spooky season officially kicks off, even though I are we like doing spooky? I was spooked up, dude. Wait, have we fallen down yet? It's fall right now, right? No, yeah, it's the twenty first. Uh, yeah, we just got fucking pumpkin wine, dude. It's on. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. pumpkin wine. I don't know what is the official twenty first. I think uh, I think it goes by the Starbucks when they come out with the pumpkin spice skin. Well, then that was, yeah. that was September. Oh, I got 1st. a two for one PSA. I got a two for one fucking PSA. Oh, dude. dude, you're fucking sick as yeah. shit. First day, dude. People have been talking shit about you, but I got your back. I know that's lit. Yeah, two for one pumpkin spice. PSL's fat too. Do that, they do anything else? Does pumpkin that stand spice. For penis sucking lips. Yes. Sick. Do they do anything else? Like, do I have to get a latte? Anything with like pumpkin or spice. <laughs> 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 um, no, it's anything that's of the season. So you could get like, um, oh, fucking pumpkin oat milk. Oh, super sh- special drink. Eat shit. Yeah. A double double yeah. pump of pumpkin. You could get a double double. Wait, what's the deal? You get um, it's two for one. At least when I went. Or maybe oh. I just looked very in season. I don't know. It's two for one <laughs> after, like, spooky. after like noon or 1 p.m. or yeah. something. I'm pretty sure that's all of fall. Or it's like two for 250, whatever weird thing they do these days. Mm. Mm-hmm. No, I think it is two for one after after like 3 p.m. or something. Every or it could be like Tuesday. Late in the day. Yeah. After, after whatever time you should not be drinking fucking coffee again. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, they're like, sure you want to? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Fuck you. Uh, oh, this is going to be a question. You, you, you have to keep it on now or else you're... I'll keep it on yeah. for a little bit longer and then, you know, we'll fill it out. Um, Garrett, I don't know if you have news this week. I have a little bit of news, but you seem like you got something. Well, this is the biggest news. I have a poem too. <laughs> <laughs> Let's save that. I want to. I don't want to get too <laughs> razzled up that quickly. I want to. I don't want to be bricked up for the rest of the pod <laughs> after you poem me down. Um, biggest news of the week by far: Taylor Swift. Yes, Travis Kelsey putting Travis Kelsey on the map. Putting Travis Kelsey. Okay, this is the thing with this. We've known about the Swift Army. Yes, the swarm. The, 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 uh, the swarm. The, the, the swarm? The Swift, Is that what it's called? It should be. The Swift Army Knives. I like that. The that s- also works with swarm, too. Yeah. Uh, Swiss Army. The Swift Entry? Swift Entry? Maybe? How about Swift Arky? The Swift Arky. Swift Arky. Swift Arky? Yeah, like yeah, the Anarchy, yeah, but yeah. it's the Swifties. Swift You're so good. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I've known about them. I've known 
that they do crazy things that they're a rabid fan base of just craziness. Mm -hmm. It's never crossed over into anything that I even remotely give a fuck about. Or paid attention to. Or paid attention to. It's not. It's always some the fucking. <laughs> they, these people are fucking nuts. Are you getting into the statue? Yeah. Well, let me guess. You saw a girl with hella ass out of. St out of no, no, no. I'm not into the. Sw I'm just amazed <laughs> okay. that her fan base is this crazy, and I'm sure I'm late to the game on it. But like I was saying, it's just never. I've never given a flying fuck. Yeah. But now it's they've got. They okay. These are the notes that I took on the things that they've done so far. <laughs> So he's been dating her for confirmed like four days at this point. Four days? Like since the game was like they were coming yeah, out. Party. Yeah, so she went to the game and she was in the box. Um, they have gone through every piece of media that he's ever been in ever in their, his entire life. One of them, they found a practice fight that he was in and they're calling for assault charges. And they're also, they're also worried that Taylor Swift should get a fucking restrainer order, restraining order so that he doesn't beat her oh, from a practice football fight. They're maniacs. And then they found an interview one time where he did a fuck, Mary kill, and she was in it. All his mom. Or and he picked her as the fuck, not the Mary. So they're like, oh, it's oh. not meant to be. Well, and this is like 10 years ago. Yeah. Well, he, she hasn't let him fuck yet, so he's still trying to do you don't think? Do you think he's fucked after four days? No, dude. Well, they've been officially dating for yeah, four Yeah, they were, were kind of... They've under, been They were under the weeks. radar, rumored for a couple weeks. And uh, he was in, a, in like his podcast... He was saying how they like after the game they s slipped away in their get getaway vehicle and he said mm -hmm. it all like ooh I we uh, snuck off to do our thing kind of oh so along with that the sneaking away there was like a thousand people outside of her box at the game <laughs> what which box the, the football box <laughs> she was in uh, <laughs> <laughs> she was in the Kelsey family box okay though. but so the there's like a thousand box? people just standing yeah. out there like because they they don't, probably don't even go to the game for football they're just yeah where's Swift I'm the swarmy they had to sneak the her out Italian. in a popcorn machine. They had to sneak her in a popcorn machine? They had to sneak Wait, her shut, out in that a popcorn. Real? That's a real shut video. Shut the fuck up. In a popcorn machine. And there's like 10 people that are like, yeah, she's in there. They stuck her on <laughs> a popcorn machine? That's incredible. No. Wait, is she like storing from inside of it? Like, oh, I don't Well, there was, there was workers who were like, yeah, that's, that's, that's Taylor, Swift. Taylor Swift that's in this Taylor popcorn Swift. box. That's incredible. There goes Taylor and she's in that popcorn yeah. thing. And she doesn't a, just have enough security to like sh her. She gets swarmed like that anywhere she goes. Yeah, it's well, I'm sure, but I'm sure their like security is still. You're just gonna get swarmed. No That's true. What. I guess she's usually also in a place where she could probably slip out the back door somewhere. If you're in a box, she's in, like, in a the stadium. Third she has to make her way stadium. out. Yeah, it's a swarmy of people. Um, I I want to know this. How many people do you think are gonna learn football because because of, of this? Oh. Like just so that they can know how good of a boyfriend. How good Travis is. Kelsey is for Taylor Swift. They're going to like, we're going to get a whole new, his Jersey sales are up 400%. 400%? 400% Jersey sales. Yeah. Really? There's going to be a ton of, of women learning football because of this. Did you they see said, Did you see the thing that she had a cheat sheet? Did she? There's a picture of a cheat sheet for the game of when she should cheer and what's good. No, no yeah, now you're making things Who up. Who would have taken a picture of that? I'm just, dude, I'm just reporting the news. That's brother. made up. <laughs> this is the news with Jay. Yeah. But is this good? Uh, yeah, let's. It should be. Though. Apparently, the uh, Chiefs Bears. I mean, Chiefs games probably would draw a large crowd. Mm -hmm. But they're playing the Bears. God awful. It was the most watched game of the week. Oh, for uh, sure. Twenty four million viewers, and then on top of that, the viewership for that game increase a sixty three percent increase with women, just for that game. How do they know that? I'm sure they just polled like a certain maybe. amount of women, maybe. And then they say, "Hey, did you watch the week's game before?" <laughs> no. Did you watch yeah. this week's game? Yes. How yeah. do they which know that? They which, don't know that. Which games did you watch? The and then Travis with, Kelsey, the one got, with Taylor Swift. <laughs> Travis Kelsey got three hundred fifty thousand more in, new Instagram followers. Oh yeah. So that's how we know how many it is. It's that many. Dude, the videos of people seeing that he's like officially dating her, like girls reacting, is the most unreal shit I've ever seen in my life. Because they like actually give a whole like whole actual fuck. Right? It's literally just like showing the article that shows they're dating, and girls are just. Ah! <laughs> they start screaming Wait, do that again for the cam. <laughs> uh, dude, please come on. No, I need, I need some, the clip. I that's need the clip. I did it for the cam. Do it's it on one the more cam. time. No, I'm not doing yeah. it again. It's say fuck you or something. Fuck just. you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, just because I need that. Some other fun stats on that. Travis and J or yeah, Travis and Jason Kelsey's podcast went to number one on Apple the next week after that. Oh, dude, they. I'm sure they scoured through every single thing. Yeah. Oh, they're trying said. to bring him down. And then. Yeah. 
interest he's gonna go down in interest in chiefs tickets for the rest of the season were viewed like triple the the amount they were the week before because girls are probably gonna want to go to the game just to see taylor in the box yeah they think she's gonna be there every game oh she probably will dude that's fucking crazy she dude. just finished that massive tour she's probably off for i just years. had no idea she just was that an fucking artist? big dude she's the biggest artist on dude. earth i know but it's years. never it's never crossed over i've never gotten to witness it i guess our fans are like that crazy i yeah. gotta do it <laughs> 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 for li- listening to us every fucking week that's fair they're yeah. equally crazy there's not as many of them yeah dude if we were in a box somewhere in somebody's box somewhere <laughs> <laughs> we were stuffed up in someone's box if we were up in somebody's box you know how crazy they'd dude, be dude if you're not in a box what are you doing you'd be a pe- he's in a piece of popcorn you have to go fucking mm-hmm. he's on his you way get out of the corn. <laughs> he's in that soda for, he's in I, that soda right there if i had a dollar for every time yeah. i had to sneak you guys out in a corn dog machine <laughs> <laughs> garrett's in between two fucking buns they're just fucking carrying him his ass out how gnarly will it be for the hatred that he will receive if they ever break up i think well, he's, that he's gonna go down oh he's definitely gonna go down they he's, don't want him no think about it what is taylor swift known for eating and Chewing up and spitting out. Breakup guys. songs. Yeah. We're, oh, it's going to be huge. He's going to hit her, dude. I'm if you're sorry. a Taylor Swift fan, what do you want for songs. the next album? Songs. Yeah. Do you want to he, Do you want to hear about how happy she is? Mm-mm. You want to hear songs about, oh, I'm in love and I love him. And no, I love you want to hear about, f- I hate him and I'm angry. They're going to be, <laughs> I can't wait. <laughs> Holy shit. <clears throat> I cannot wait for the, they break up. The f- next hit song is going to have so many football references in it. <laughs> <laughs> he was on the 20 Would be lit if Chiefs made it to the Super Bowl. She was supposed to do the Super Bowl this year. Probably be the first time that's ever happened. Definitely. Boyfriend, what are the girlfriend? odds of that happening? Guy yeah. guy playing and, and girlfriend performing. That's a first But time. she turned it down. Power I, couple. I guarantee she, she, like, if they are looking like they're going to make it, or if they're even still dating at the She's going to cameo with Cause, Usher. Because who was supposed to play and they ca- got canceled? I think it was Lizzo. <laughs> I swear to God, it was supposed to be Lizzo, and she got canceled basically. Yeah. So then she, they offered it to Taylor Swift, and she turned it down. But I bet she'll take it if they're still in the running, dude. If Lizzo was playing all I the think linemen, Usher just signed officially. Oh yeah. really? Usher's I signed. bet she'll she'll come out, dude. If Lizzo was playing, that would be the first ever like Super Bowl thing that all the linemen are just like, yo. <laughs> all of them are like, yo, can like, we dude. skip the halftime? We need to go check. <laughs> dude, I'm about to say what's up after this. Maybe the first time a uh, halftime performer is suited up to play O line in the second half. Yeah. <laughs> She's fucking in. We got Lizzo at center. <laughs> the first time a player on yeah. the field performs. Yeah. <laughs> and she's fucking, she's got stats. And too. she's, yeah, five sacks going in the halftime. Yeah. <laughs> five sacks on offense. Fuck it. She's on playing both sides. Yeah, no, she's playing both ways. Yeah. There's if Lizzo's on the team, you think you're going to waste her on no, one side of the field? Both no sides. Yeah. Nose tackle and center. Nose tackle, center, yeah. running back. Running back, <laughs> try to bring that down. Quarterback, are you gonna tackle her? <laughs> By the way, have you seen the video of the the BBL basketball league where the lady fucking busts her knee? Oh, yes, she snapped her leg. Have you seen that? It's one of the best videos of all time. It's just BBL. All, I'm pretty it's, sure it's literally called like a B, the BBL basketball league. Yeah, it's all these ladies with obvious fake BBLs. asses, and one of them's just like drib- they're all terrible. They're oh, like I slapping it, yeah. the ball, and she just fucking. I don't think her shit. She literally like snapped her leg. Oh yeah. Like I don't dead. think it was her knee. Like she snapped her leg. She's gonna be on a fucking yeah, like a hobble foot. She just for had a while. way too much. Wait, like knee went, weight. knee went backwards with it or what? No, uh, no. Toe, no like I'm, toes I'm, touched upper thigh, like front thigh. So the knee went fucking reverse. What, what's up with it? She snapped the fuck. Hyperextend knee oh. frontwards, and it fucking bent up. Like yeah. say what's up? Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, she's got that BBL, so much weight on it, dude. Yeah. Oh. Oh yeah. Not designed for that much that much load bearing. Mm-hmm. Oh, it's not. To, <laughs> that's so many loads. You can't get. The, they got lower bone density. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's good shit. But that was my big news. It just had to be talked about. That that was good. There's some crazy people out there. I've got I've got a conspiracy, but I don't I don't know if we want to jump right into it. No, yeah, absolutely, dude. Maybe. You're getting us with all this <laughs> poem conspiracy come at us. Well, okay, so oh, wait, he has a poem. Is it a poem conspiracy? Huh? No, it's not. Okay, no. I, I, it was a poem about spooky season, but I, I just, I don't know. Read it. It's, read it. Read the poem. Read the poem. Read the poem. Read the poem. You got to do it now. No, it was, it was, I read just it. had chat GPT read it. It's not. Read it. Read it. <laughs> I wanted to open. He's been working on it for hours. I wanted, he tries to, to, blame it on I chat wanted to open this, the episode with it. Read it's, it. It's actually kind of good. So read it's not it. even funny. Read it. Like, it's just a good poem. Just okay. read it. It's also way too long. It'll give me it. <laughs> <laughs> right. He wrote this. This Go. was not chat GPT. No, I could show you. It's going to say by Garib Well, I don't, I just thought the first, I just thought the first line was funny because you enjoy this <laughs> the moon a pale ghost <laughs> in the night's abyss cast shadows long where mysteries persist 
in haunted houses and cornfields wide. Ghosts and goblins begin their eerie stride. Ooh. Ooh, I'm gonna, uh, <laughs> is it more? Yo, it's, Don't it's, stop. It's long. Don't stop. Pumpkins carved with faces aglow. Their flickering eyes in the darkness they show. A spectral dance of leaves in the breeze as whispers of legends rustle through the trees. Go orange for this. The air grows cold. The nights grow long as the spirits emerge with their spectral song. Spectral dawn. In the heart of October, where magic abounds, spooky season enchants with its haunting sounds. Ooh. So embrace the chill, the shadows, the night. In spooky season's embrace, it's quite a sight. For in the world of ghosts and dreams, spooky season's magic forever gleams. Wow. That doesn't get you gassed up for a little spook. It gets me gassed up, but it also makes me think how fucking gay you have to be to write poems. <laughs> <laughs> you have to want ass now. Yeah, no, that like, wasn't. It's like, been too long. That wasn't in my notes. Like... That was a that was a chat GB. Out of all the ways there is to get pussy, <laughs> at some point in time, the seventeen hundreds, they're like, we need to write more, dude. But I'm just saying uh, that if that can't be your first choice, right? Like, you're out there, single dude. You try ten other things before you try writing poetry, right? Or do but, you go if you go straight to poetry? No, it's it's fun when no one else knows how to fucking write though. Like you th start throwing in words like doth and half. Like ooh, it was and it, where doth art thou? Like, like, no <laughs> was, <laughs> fuck, I'm more Where doth that ass? Yeah. Poets were probably getting mad clam back in the days when that was like the coolest thing. But yeah. now it's like if you're gonna do Dude, poetry, I think wenches make... didn't even know how to fucking understand what they're saying back then. <laughs> That's why they were probably just you're so, over... they were so enamored by it. They're like, whoa, I don't yeah. even know. Think about your like town poet, how ass he was compared to like fucking Shakespeare back then. Yeah, but oh, you yeah. didn't know that. That's what I'm saying. You could just fucking be out there. You have was, three rhymes. Yeah. That guy was banging everyone's wife. It's like the first caveman that learned how to fucking talk or something. Like, I, guy's getting ass somehow. The first caveman to learn how to talk? <laughs> yeah, he's getting I wonder more if ass. He's like, yo, come back to my place. And they're like, <laughs> Yeah, he's the only guy that can say come back to what my place. What if that's place? how book club started? Some fucking poet would just swindle all the wives into a house one like one night a week and just fucking oh, rail them all? <laughs> mm. <laughs> like, oh, we're going mm. to book club. Church. <laughs> yeah, it was church. Church started. Yeah, yeah it's another church. spiritual yeah. language. Hath, doth. Yeah. Lordus. Ye. <laughs> <laughs> Where art. Art yeah. thou. Yeah. Jesus Christ. I must know. All right, so this is a this is it. The poem we get we get on the poem. <laughs> <laughs> I'm good on the poem. So this is. A but hold on, no, no, no. You don't just get to do. <laughs> you're just gonna do a poem. What sequence of thoughts had to happen yeah, no, in a row? Yeah, yeah, wait a second. Yeah, I wanted to come up with a fun little spooky season thing to, <laughs> to kick off the episode. And you typed fun little spooky season thing. No, I I said write me a, a poem about spooky season. I'm gonna pull up Jappy Chappy G B G B G B G B G P P. I, th I thought it'd be fun to have a cute little poem to start the episode, and you guys just jumped right in. No, I, I, I love me it. a poem it was gonna about be how spooky my boy's cock is. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they can't do Oh, oh, it's not doing it. Okay, I'll do it. Uh, my boy's pen. My and boy's we'll pen. Just do cock. <laughs> we'll just replace. Poem about a spooky pen. How spooky. My boy's pen. My boy's pen is. Uh, yeah. <laughs> you pen like that? is. <laughs> Very nice. Okay. Oh, it still knows. It knows. It knows. It's smart. It gets pen is. It said, I understand you'd like a poem. It's understanding. <laughs> <laughs> it's understanding. At least it's understanding. It yeah. gets it. It gets us. Um, but I cannot generate explicit or inappropriate content, which is bullshit. Did you put a space? Yeah, I put. Pen is. <laughs> I put a space. Okay, let me try something else. About what? a spooky pen that my boy owns. Okay, there, mm, there we're we gonna go. find a way around. Oh, this. this is good podcasting. And then it way. writes one with penis in it. <laughs> <laughs> my boy's got a thick chubby cock. <laughs> it knows. It how about okay? How about like how hawk. spooky my boy's chicken is? Pumpkin. Because then it'll get okay. Just word any word. The right way. Okay. Word it the way I said. Pumpkin about. is. It's way too long. <laughs> yeah, no, it went all in on mine. I skipped like four stanzas. Okay, I'm just going to pick this stanza here. Um, for pumpkins like yours, so spooky and bold, <laughs> are treasures of autumn worth more than gold? Mm. Insert penis. Okay. They okay. remind us of tales and folklore's charms as we gather round safe in each other's arms. On each other's cocks. On each other's cocks. Yes, yes. Yeah. Okay. I like that. Okay, good. Should we write gay poetry? Dude, we need to get into the sus, the sus. We've been talking song. about sus rap. Well, so you know that guy that we we worship. 
<laughs> yeah, what's his name again? Well, I didn't know his country one is Dixon Dallas. Dixon Dallas. He has a million monthly listeners on Spotify. This guy's raking Yeah, no, cash. He, he absolutely rips. And his other project, which is like the pop punk one, is like fucking... The Red was actually kind of Has a couple hundred thousand monthly. So this guy's just making a, an absolute living off of sus songs. Should but they're get, actually fire. I think, I think we should go with more of like a sus... Because I don't know if we could write... I guess you guys could. We can, huh. we you guys make music, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> you guys can make a full song. I was thinking more of like a sus Weird Al. Yeah. Like... Oh, like, like parodies. Yeah. Well, like, we are good at that. We yeah, do that yeah. every day. And that's what I'm saying. We wake up every morning and, we, we and it comes that. right to us. What was today's song? Wonderwall? Wonderwall. Wonderwall, we were ripping today. Heavily. Um, we also got... You're my dick and bone. Yeah, see, yeah exactly. Yeah, it's so easy. easy. We were going ham it's on that It's too easy today. to do that. We can, can we do side project? Yeah. yeah. Uh, if like it was a, like by all three of us, too. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You guys you guys uh, write and produce, and I'll lyricize. Yeah. Okay. I can, I can Just a, that. a chance for us to really come together. You know, I always feel left out on the music stuff. Join stuff. forces. That's, that's possible. It's a chance for me to just really be in there. To shine. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we could do that. And I'll write the gayest shit, dude. I promise. You promise? I promise. <laughs> okay. As long as you promise. I, I know for a fact. <laughs> <laughs> so poetry's fucking lit. Okay, yeah. yeah. Uh, in the news, poetry's up 400%. Ooh. Just water. Just water. We're good. Um... I don't know what it, I've got a couple of like just little things. Well, I, I <clears throat> I've got a bunch of those. I came up with my own entire conspiracy today, and I want the boys to elaborate on this. With okay, me. go for it. I was going to bring go, it go, up. Go. go. So, this st- stemmed from the news that Target is closing uh, nine stores in four major cities, um, two of them being in California, mm-hmm. uh, mostly because of this new law, right? Yeah. That you can pretty much fucking steal shit everywhere. It says the law. Um, are you going to give the law? Well, we've we've talked about it before, but you can. This is only in California specifically, yeah. but you can not be charged for theft for anything under nine hundred fifty dollars. Yes, okay. okay. But other states have similar laws, so they are calling them like targeted organizational, like thievery operations, basically. Target. Organized thieve, thieving operations. Te- where people are just going into ransacking. They're calling so it's in like every major Toters. city. <clears throat> yeah, they're totes. It's in like every major city right now. Mm-hmm. So. I have a conspiracy okay. that Amazon somehow lobbied local governments into doing this to shut down retail stores across the country. I already love it. Entirely. I already love it That's so much. Oh, you can only order shit online because it's just gotten to the point where CVS closed all their stores in San Francisco. Boom. I already love it. Yeah, this is the best There's conspiracy I've heard in a while. millions of dollars. Yeah. Target's shutting down nine of its stores in, in four major cities. Yeah. They, they're toppling. So what you're saying essentially is Bezos... Girl boss the industry. He girl boss the industry <laughs> <laughs> into into just saying there just won't be retail stores. Yeah. Oh, go ahead and try and buy. Well, and yes, because okay, <laughs> yeah, I think imagine, that's it. Imagine Target's gone. Right? People aren't going to go to Target.com to buy shit. They're going to go to Amazon. No yeah, one buys. I've never gone to Target.com in my no, life. You yeah. just go to Target. And and Target and Walmart are the only other places. I'm going go to go to Target.com right now to though. buy anything. Exactly. Really. I'm going to go to Target. What places are getting absolutely ransacked the most? Those two places, dude. They, I went to Target, actually, what was it, Walmart? I went to Walmart the other day. They had a $9.99 thing behind the fucking, the tag that you have to, like, get someone to open up the thing for you. Really? They have, like, oh, locked, like locked up stuff for nine tags. Over $10? It was, no, it was just, like, I don't know what the price was, because there was things that oh, were, like, you're $5. saying it was only, like, it was that cheap, and they still had yeah, to lock it Yeah, it was $9. It depends on the, uh, like, it was the, in, the item. Yeah, like, so category. it was in electronics. Uh, electronics... But, uh, like razors or self care stuff is all locked up, but you could still walk out and smash the box. Like it's in a. Oh, you could do box. whatever you want. Yeah. Well, no. It, oh no, this is the other part. Why I was wearing this mask. <laughs> I was at CVS and the batteries were on it, and then I just go and just rip it off. Like I just go to take it off and I just ripped through it because battery the things are made out of just cardboard. Oh, it so was, I was just locked like, on the like. Oh, yeah, I didn't even yeah. notice it was locked, and I just grabbed it and took it right and off. And ripped the little cover. <laughs> I was like, oh, shit, it was fucking locked on there. <laughs> oh, my uh, God. Yeah. That's classic. But, no, that, I think, yeah, because Tar- Target.com Amazon's- is ass. So some sort of elaborate, like, lobbying plot or something is is putting That's, this into effect. It's not even that elaborate. Like, how much more is fucking Amazon worth more than Target? It's just got to be worth more, and they'll do it. Well, yeah. You know? I mean, I I would say that Target is cheap but the cheapness compared to just it's it just comes cheaper. down to can you wait a day 
Can yeah. you wait one day? And for me, it's usually you could get no. everything on Amazon for the same the or less. Amount. Yeah. But can you wait a day? Like, yeah. do you need it? It comes down to do you need it right this minute? Yeah, that's why like Home Depot and that kind of shit is still in business. Cause, like I need. Well, think about how much if there was no retail stores, how much more money they would make where they could do same day on almost everything. And, and you know what Amazon? Oh wants? yeah, because they're just making that much money to where like, they could the, be like, yeah, yeah, we'll deliver it in three hours. Yeah, literally. You know how we? Thing. You know how we check this? As, <laughs> as soon as <laughs> as soon as either of the two go out of business, we see who buys the fucking location. Turns like if Amazon, Amazon buys it as a warehouse. Oh my god! Like, no. like yeah. if they had I'm a warehouse for every time, I'm writing it down. Yeah. Writing it down. Writing that'd it down. be that'd be perfect. You, you're getting it today every time because you could get today shipping now. So yeah. should I did, did you know type that? in track Amazon warehouse purchases? Yeah, nine months from now. Yeah, like nine a, months reminder. Let yeah. this baby let this baby breed. Nine let months. let that really fucking let that go sublimate sublimate similar to coagulate. <laughs> <laughs> nine months from now. That's going at the top of my list of future reminders. Yeah, I could bet that'll be a thing. I mean, yeah, that's that's not even. First of all, you did you come up that. with that yourself? No, he didn't. No, he didn't. <laughs> huh, did swear, you no, see he didn't. a tweet of a TikTok or something? I swear, no, he like, saw something on accident, forgot about, it, and then his subconscious like I, you're hella smart. No, I swear my life. Like, I, all, I uh, all I did was screenshot. All I did was all I did was screenshot this. What was it? Just the the Instagram story that I saw. Okay, and you and I literally you just fulgamated that yourself. I yeah. I just came up with that. You fulgamated. I'm it. sure I'm not the only person to have thought of something like that, but <clears> no, <throat> I w don't shortchange yourself. Yeah. Yes, you are. Uh, yeah. You're I'm at the front lines. I am. You're in the trenches. I'm in the trenches. You're out here fighting. A huge moment. I, I might get murdered for this. First of all, if you do get murdered, we know who did it. I want we your know body why, next day. We know we, Bezos. Conspiracy. Yeah. If he gets murdered, conspiracy proved. If he gets murdered, it's true. That might be the easiest way to co to confirm a conspiracy. If someone says something and then dies, no, because well, I haven't died yet. Well, that's what well, that's how we know none of yours are real. <laughs> I, know, I know, I know. <sighs> no, I mean that happens all the fucking time, though. You're like, okay, well, that was for sure real. Mm -hmm. No, there's some crazy. Alex Jones would be fucking. No, I guess he's always wrong too. No, he's no, always he's right. right. He's actually weirdly okay, right. He should be dead then. If anyone, I feel like he. They let him be real because no one believes yeah, him. Yeah, no one believes yes. him. No one be he has, yeah, he has literally dug his own grave already. Yeah. No one believes anything. The yeah. Sandy Hook one, he went too far in it. Just, yeah. Dude, yeah. I can't believe he could As soon as he did that. How could you not think of the angle that, hey, I look crazy? That, what do you mean? That's uh, that's why he's so big. I, I look and sound crazy. But also, is if he you just give us facts without he, yelling at us. Is he <laughs> only crazy because he's been right for so long and no one listens to him? No, he's crazy because he's loud and obnoxious. When that yeah, his presentation is bad. No, I always want him to be right. No, but he's he, we've always, you always we've only seen him, him be right. Yeah. <laughs> we've only seen him since he's gotten super popular, and you only see like the viral crazy clips. Like, yeah, he's been doing this shit for like twenty years. Yeah, and maybe he's just been right so many times and no one will listen to Has him. Has he ever been wrong? Uh, yes. Yeah. 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 Oh yeah. <laughs> uh, fuck yeah. But he's been right on some big ass shit yeah. for sure. Like the frogs. Yeah, they're turning yeah. people. They're turning no, that was when he's right on. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. What is it? The chemicals that are going in the water or something? Yeah, it's increasing our estrogen levels. Yeah. Boom. But that, but but saying it's Turn. turning the frogs gay versus that's clicks, the baby. Water, that's the showbiz. water does have some, or whatever it is, aspect. But of that's it. also like this guy has ten hours of content a week, and we see like a thirty second clip once a month. Yeah. You know what? You know what I was thinking about with Alex Jones. Remember, there's a guy, some writer, who there's like a there's a thing about like his day, right? And he's like, oh, wake up, snort six lines. Oh, drink, this is like, um, the guy who made the movie Blow. Yes, that guy. You'd be surprised how many people artists do this. But so that's what I'm saying. Alex Jones, when he dies, there's gonna be something that comes out, and it says Alex Jones wakes up in the morning, like takes four Tesla pills. Like eat ten frogs. <laughs> like, yeah, <laughs> it's gonna be the same sort of yeah. thing to where he's like, right before he goes on camera, he fucking rips six lines and fucking takes like a fucking eight ounces of mushrooms and just starts going. Yeah, there's no way he's not on that same it, level. It's definitely stuff. ecstasy all day. <laughs> it has to be something. Yeah. Or like, what the fuck was that guy's name? Or like a fucking nicotine patch, but it's coke. That's him. Yeah, he's yeah. he's a coke patch. he's budding coke. Yeah, he's budding coke. And he has a slower. He butts an eight ball right before he goes on cam. Yeah, it's like super dense coke that you put in your butt, and it only dissolves like over a long period super of time. Super dense coke. Yeah, it's like um like the stuff like Big Bang Coke, like it's super dense. Yeah, compact. it's very dense. Yeah, <laughs> it's pressurized. Oh, it's Hunter S. Thompson. No, it's he, like a jawbreaker of coke. 
He wrote Fear and Loathing in Las Vegas. <laughs> <laughs> but you put it in your ass. It's slow release, yeah. but it's a thick. slow break at yeah. ass cock or ass coke breaker. There ass cock coke. Ass perfect. Coke breaker. Um, <laughs> <laughs> a, an XR cocaine yeah. pill? An mm-hmm. XR cocaine ass jawbreaker, but turned up to 50 MIGs. Yeah. Yeah. 50 MIGs, baby. <laughs> Suck it. Um, this is a question for you guys. I just want to know your answer. <laughs> I hope so. That's is what it, question I just want to know straight up. <laughs> That's I, don't, I don't need a work. whole. I don't want a whole like explanation. Okay. I just want to know your direct answer to this. Okay. Is it weirder to make eye contact with someone while you're drinking from a fountain, like a water fountain, or to close your eyes while you're doing it? Fuck. Can you re- read it? Run it back. I need to picture it in my mind. You're drinking from a water fountain in a public place. Yes. Is it weirder to while you're tilted? make eye contact with someone who's like maybe waiting or to close your eyes while you do it. Cause closing your eyes is kind of sus. <laughs> <laughs> also the eye contact's kind of sus depending it's like, on who's there. If your eyes are closed, you're like, how, why is that so good for yeah. you? Yeah. If you, if your eyes are closed yeah. and you look way too happy. Yeah. Why are you enjoying it so much? And enjoying bend, but see, this is what I didn't want. This is what yeah. I didn't want. I just want the answer. I just want to pick. What's the question again? <laughs> <laughs> eyes closed or eye contact. While you're drinking from water fountain. What's weirder? Yeah. Eyes closed. Because eye contact means the person's are, also looking at you. Well, they're waiting for you to finish. So, so they're, they're looking, looking at, at they're you. They're looking at you either way. So it's whether or not your eyes are open or closed. They're looking at you and they see your eyes closed. But they're looking at you in the eyes. That's the weirder part. Well, but they're it's because <laughs> think, you assert think about when someone's drinking the water fountain in front of you, you're like, hurry the fuck up. Like no, I'm patient. I think you assert dominance and stare him dead in the eyes. <laughs> that's yeah. That's how you know you you both are in it to win it. I had a moment yesterday at the gym where I was drinking from the water fountain and I looked up. Looked and at me. I looked and, I was and there was you. there was someone waiting and they were looking right at me and I like looked at them and I thought to myself, should I close my eyes? <laughs> that would be weirder. You close. You're like sitting there. All of a sudden, you close. Them okay, it's like me. just imagine me like looking at you and then I'm just like. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's it's definitely. If you start off, I don't off, like whatever that was. Yeah. You don't like that. Opposite yeah. of that. Okay, it's well, definitely weirder if I you know. start if you start looking at them. Then it creates a whole new dynamic. Mm. Like if you close your eyes after you've already looked at them. Yeah, yeah. That's but or do you hold the eye contact? Because I'm not you, looking away. I'm not losing dominance. I'm not dominance, dominoes, dominance. Jesus. You're bent over sucking something and you think you have dominance? Mm, yeah. <laughs> yeah, no if way. I'm bent over sucking something and I can hold eye contact longer than you can, that's dominance and it's fucking that is That is pure dominance. If you look yeah. away first while I'm... Yeah. You're fucking me, but I'm dominating you. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's way worse to close your eyes. Okay. I think you just got dominated. All right, ladies and gentlemen, Here we're we going to take a and quick break Here we from the show go. because it's fucking spooky season, it's motherfucker. Spooky season. And there's nothing Garrett. worse than what season having, is it? It's spooky as shit. Yeah, nothing okay. scarier than a fucking set of hairy balls. Yeah, and there's nothing, literally nothing scarier than that John's cock. And, and there's fucking, untrimmed nothing. Yeah. So. Untrimmed by the doctor yes. the day you were bo- born uncircumcised. Yeah. So this, this Manscaped doesn't do season. circumcisions. Manscaped, but the Manscaped can't circumcise you because it can't cut your shit, dude. It's yes. too good. It's a no nick it's, technology. It's all no nick. It's tech. low nick. Check no the nick. USPTA. Go nick. They've got the patent. But keep that in mind this spooky season because Manscaped are committed to helping men around the world walk and talk with some swagger this season with the best grooming tools on the market. Try and fucking do a circumcision with one of their things. You can't. <laughs> yeah, you can. I've tried to do it. I've tried. I, I promise. I'm not. So even when you're dressed as Ken and your dumb girlfriend's dressed as Barbie. Mm-hmm. You'll have an uncensored but fully trimmed cock. <laughs> Join, You'll still be bulged up. <laughs> Join the 9 million men worldwide. That seems like a small number. It's it sh- not, though. It should be 4 billion. Well, if you think about how many it should be, yeah. How yeah. many men are there on Earth? That's how many it should be. Four, at least 4 billion. And then it should be times two. Yeah. Yeah, double it. Yeah. Because you should well, have Manscaped. Two. Let's go, baby. <laughs> <laughs> but anyways, you should trust us and fucking head over to this. Yeah, dude, if anyone knows balls. Yeah. The boys know their the boys balls. The boys know balls. Yeah. The boys know big, Coming from fat. guys who frequently have them inside their mouth, we know <laughs> balls. Yeah, you want to know how to taste uh, them? You can't taste them as good with hair. You That's cannot. You Manscaped. Just- <laughs> Manscaped. <laughs> but enjoy this offer this spooky season. 20% off and free shipping if you go through the boys. Code no FOMO at checkout. Manscaped.com. 
Don't neglect your beautiful I self. I don't think we've ever spelled it before. That's huge. Get right this spooky season with Manscaped and no FOMO. No FOMO at checkout. Gang, gang, back to the show. Gang, gang. All right, go for it, Jack. You ready for this? Okay. You ready? I'm crunching the way up here. You get to ask your boy one question on a lie detector. What are you asking him? That's good. That's gnarly. Why are you gay? <laughs> <laughs> Have you had a gay thought towards me? <laughs> yeah, right? That's that exactly what I was saying. <laughs> Even if it was that's bad. Not, that's what I'm yeah. saying. It's like one time yeah. when we were talking and joking yeah. around, you could ever count yeah. my chub. The energy. <laughs> yeah. has to be that. Like we're laying in a bed hungover, we're giggling or whatever yeah. and some shit. We're giggling then, a little too yeah. hard in a, in a dark room alone. Because uh, you know the answer for you is also. So yeah. we all, <laughs> you just want to justify. <laughs> uh, so we all thought it. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah. Um, but. <laughs> <laughs> Well, okay. Wait. Well, one thing going. Oh no, yeah. Oh yeah. Move going on. along with that. Move on for sure. Going no, no, along with that. We can elaborate. That. No, is, we can elaborate. Yeah. This is just kind of goes oh, with like the same scenario. Specific sighting. This kind of goes with the same yeah. scenario. Uh, it's a little advice for our Ocean Pacific bros out there. This is a gym we go to. We're new here. Uh, we've been going. If you're a muscle guy, you're wearing one of those nipple tanks, and you're in the outside section, and you're sitting on the little swing chairs that they have. If you're swinging back and forth and giggling at each other <laughs> outside in the sun, stop <laughs> unless you're going to invite me because <laughs> yeah. it looked like a fun-ass time. It looks yeah. like an absolute The ball. other day, me and Morg were there. I saw these two guys. They had a camera set up in the corner. They had a camera set They were, up? like, definitely filming their lifts, guys. Like, nipple, nipple tanks. Yeah. And they're sitting there and they're swinging so hard on the swings, like and they're swinging. And well, they're just, they're, their legs are so big and strong. Because yeah. they're just and they're swinging back and forth and they look at each other and they're just like, Ooh. and I was like, yo, invite me first, dude. I have so many bones to pick with strong guys. Actually, now that I think about it, <laughs> break it down. Okay, you're not stronger than me. <laughs> <laughs> I could be stronger than you if yeah. I wanted to. I see you. You're not stronger than me. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Keep it going. I see what you're trying to do, and it's not working. Yeah, <laughs> no, okay. absolutely not. But here's the thing. Okay. If you're big, you don't also get to be loud. And oh. you don't also get to talk about girls in public so that other people can hear. Oh, I forgot about that guy. You also don't get to be loud while you're lifting, and you don't get to wear super little stuff at the gym. I'm sorry. I don't understand this, and I'll never understand it. Why is it the jackter you get, the tighter your fuck, the more bikini strap you get? Yeah. Like, it, why the more jacked you get, do you have to get more, like, like less? Like, it's the more obvious it I is can that you're see big, it. the less you wear. Yeah, like, I can <laughs> see yeah. it more, and you're wearing less. Yeah, I mean, I it'd be cool if you have a fat ass and you're a girl. Like, it's, you just need yeah, well, that. Now we're kinda, talking. It's kind of yeah. the same mentality as a girl getting a massive fat rack, but wearing, like, Barely covering her nipples. Yeah, bikini. that is okay. Yeah, we'd like yeah. that. <laughs> but the other way, it's like it, it's cool to be jacked if it if you don't look like the guy that's trying to look like the guy that's jacked. Does that make sense? I think that's a I big do, part I of do it. Get yeah. it. Like it's cool to be jacked if it's like low key. Yeah. Like oh shit, you're jacked, brother. Holy shit. I but mean, if the, you're like yelling and shit, then you can fucking eat your own ass. I think the big thing for me was just like, if you guys are gonna have a good time and be little gay bros together, invite me. Yeah. Be there with that's me. That's fair. Like, they look like they're having the... I've never seen two guys... They were kicking their feet out swinging. Yeah. Like, getting the extended... Why is there a swing at the gym? Uh, the outside section has, like, these little chairs that you can sit on Just that, like that are on ropes, and you can swing out. Sounds lit. And I heard the Might fucking... Might have to start going to the gym. I heard the happiest little giggle out of them, and I was yeah. like, fuck. They were pretty Me happy, Me and Morgan never do that anymore. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I should get more jacked. But, uh, sorry for the tangent there. We're sticking with... No, I, th I feel like there's one more thing to do here. I think there's a lot of embarrassing questions you could ask. Like, have you ever jacked off to, like, a weird porn? Yeah. Like, if you had one lie detector question. Like, who's your best friend? Oh, no, but it has to be a yes or no question for lie detector. No, it doesn't. Yeah, it does. It's a lie detector. No, you have to do yes or no. Though. I think for accuracy, it does. Yeah, because they ask you like. So you could say, oh, "Am I your best be friend? Am I yeah. your best friend?" Okay. Yeah, that's what it is. They, and the, the answer is question, no. Baseline questions are like, "Is your name this?" Yeah. Do you live at this address? Yeah. Or is your dick bigger than mine? Mm. 
Hard or soft? That's, yeah. Then you have to soft. Hit. Absolutely. You have to act. Yeah. You have to add those in. Yeah. So one of those. I three. think am I your best friend would be another good one. Am I your best friend is a good one. Yeah. And then the answer is no, and then they're they're telling the truth. <laughs> <laughs> if you're me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That was uh, sad. <laughs> that ruined my fucking night. Uh, it's funny because in my head, I thought you said the fucking opposite. <laughs> <laughs> that was a good question, though. That's a good one. Think okay. on that. Think on that. That is good. Next episode, we're getting a lie detector. <laughs> should we yeah. get a lie detector? We should do a lie one? detector episode. And can we get the weird guy that's in the corner, like, working it? Oh, yeah, I want a fucking absolute, yeah. like, Ocean's Eleven, the guy who sweats when he's trying Wait, to Wait, we do totally it. should rent a fucking lie, lie detector, detector guy? I'm going to look up episode. how much it is. Like, a stringy-haired type guy. Yeah, like serial killer looking. Yeah, is masturbating. He's like table. super tall mm -hmm. for no reason. Lanky, very stringy hair. Yeah, <laughs> very stringy hair. Greasy, S super thin yeah. glasses. Yeah, smells like Korean barbecue almonds. <laughs> smells like very yeah. Guys, we're almost just talking about me. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> okay, okay. I don't think you guys are ready for this answer. Fifteen hundred. Several hundred to a few thousand. <laughs> Is the answer for how well, expensive surprised. a lie detector is? Like, what differentiates you, right? Let me just type in polygraph. Well, no, I don't think you just can't buy one of them. A lie detector? I don't know if you can just go out and buy. Yeah, one. you can. They're Maybe we have to find like a shutdown no, like police. Super accurate ones. Yeah, they're at Target. That's why Amazon wants them. <laughs> polygraph <laughs> machine price. Okay, you can get a bunch of bullshit ones for like three hundred dollars, which might be better. Yeah. No. <laughs> That would be way better if they're just wrong the whole time and we're just trying to yeah. debate our way out. Yeah, let's just get a one that... That would be fun, actually. You yeah. actually don't know if it's right or wrong, and you just get to play off of the... the You're just like, no, game. this dude, it's bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> we should just do, like, an app that it just hears yeah. you, and it's like, oh. <laughs> well, okay, here's the question. We don't have to buy one. We just hire a guy for an hour. That's got to be doable. What do you mean, hire a guy for an hour? Like someone who does lie detecting? Like, just by looking at you? No, you hire a guy who has one, they come for an hour. No, fuck! Isn't that what we're doing? I thought you were talking about how much it costs to buy a lie detector. Why the fuck would we buy a lie okay, detector? Okay, so obviously it's not a few <laughs> hundred thousand dollars to fucking hire a lie detector yeah. guy. I'm saying fucking, I got $70 on it. <laughs> <laughs> I'd put $7 on it. Yeah. Wait, why don't we just buy one on Amazon and return it? We could do that. That's why they did the Target shit. Conspiracy That's theory what comes back. I just back. said, dude. We could okay. do that easy. Write, write that, that down. Uh, write that down. Nine months. <laughs> Nine I don't months from like, now. I don't know if they have like legit ass ones on here, but they probably are. They got. I'll Target. look into. I'll look into it. Okay, please. Sort by height. Because well, we could just do the thirty minutes. Get them at the half price. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, no, they have real ones that are like a thousand bucks. Uh, and we'll just return it. Yeah, we'll just return it after we use it. Because it doesn't work. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's set up it gay, work. bro. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> just, this sounds dick. bullshit, bro. Yeah. <coughs> this thing thinks I'm fucking gay. All right, you guys ready for some? You, you, you teasing still? Or can no, I tease? No, I'm, 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 I'm going to put this You're out of teasing? Out. You're done teasing me? I'm done. Okay. Hit me. Which of your intrusive thoughts would be the best if you had to do it every time? <laughs> If I had to do it every day. It's fucked yeah. up because the ones that went through my head, I can't say. <laughs> oh, no, like absolutely not. I already not. had the intrusive thoughts while you... Oh, Wait, no, what I are thought, those? I thought, what are those? No, I thought the thoughts he wanted me to <laughs> say, but I can't. Literally can't say them. What are the intrusive... Um, okay, the ones I can't say, or I could say these ones, some of them. Like, it's just best. best All I want to say is the first bad. two that popped in my head could not say out loud in, with, okay. on camera. Ones that would be the best if I had to do them every time would just be like... Murder this fucking. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah like, that would be the best. That was that like, was one of mine. Yeah, like um, this guy's fucking walking too slow. Beat him in the back. Yeah, of the back. <laughs> just kill yeah. Him. or like just kicking out the back of somebody's leg. Yeah, yeah, like, like someone in a wheelchair is in front of you and you're Ooh. like slash the tires. You know what would be good? Crashing your fucking car into somebody. Oh, uh, like just ramming somebody, hitting a pedestrian. Oh, <laughs> no, okay. that's a fucking. That's so another that's, good one. Another good yeah. one. And this one's a little maybe quiche. Yeah. It's a little out, outside there. <laughs> Jumping off a bridge. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, you're just, just like, like ah, yeah. I, I can yeah, get into that's, it. That's only fun for half a time. And then, like a high balcony. Yeah. I could do that once. Yeah. Oh, or like jumping off something high. Like, yeah. like what if I just fucking. My intrusive actually. thoughts would be real. Like, the amount of them that I'd have to do would be so short if I. Yeah. 
Like, you know, <laughs> like the amount of times you peek off like a balcony in like a tall building. You're yeah, like, you're like, what if I did it? Yeah, like, dude, I could Superman yeah. land off this. I'm not that depressed. Fucking yeah, I'm not that depressed. <laughs> I swear, I'm not that depressed. Um, but um, having to drink every time that you think about it, ooh, would be pretty. Oh, that doesn't. That's called alcohol. That doesn't happen for me that often. <laughs> No, nope, it doesn't do happen it? that often. Oh, yeah, it totally it, doesn't. But tell me, <laughs> so tell me if it happens once, you have one, and then you're just like, oh, what if you had another? Like, as soon as you have one, it's just like, let's have another, let's have another, let's have another. Oh, if you just, oh, so yeah, as soon as you had one thought about yeah. it, then you had to do it. Then yeah, your next thought would be like, oh, I, I definitely don't want to do it. <laughs> <laughs> you'd see another one. Yeah, or you'd... bumps would be tough. Oh, yeah. Oh, if you, you die. If you die. had to do your intrusive thoughts on drugs. Yeah. Another one would just be you'd be dead. You'd be music. dead in yeah. one day. Not only the intrusive thoughts about drugs, but the intrusive thoughts you have when you're on drugs. Or like <laughs> yeah. you know, you know, anytime you watch a movie and someone's doing drugs in the movie, yeah. Like if you watch, if you watch like The Sopranos or something, and they were doing a line in it, you just you'd be dead in five seconds. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you'd be game over. Oh yeah, try, try sitting through Wolf of Wall Street, <laughs> and come out alive. With every yeah, as thought. soon as that rule gets enacted, you watch yeah. Wolf, Wolf of Wall Street. Oh, yeah, you never you're done. watch. You're done. Yeah, you would definitely get alcoholism very quickly, or like buying shit, buying shit. Alcoholism, or I'd be, or I just start having to tell people I have Tourette's because I'd just be fucking screaming shit at people. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like when you're walking anywhere and you're just like, no, no, no. <laughs> or like running over the person who like gives you the uh when you stopped like before the stop sign. Oh, they're like, Ooh, the oh yeah, you creeped a little. I'm like, bit I fucking the... stop. Yeah, bitch. I did that fucking like an hour and a half ago. This guy looked at me in the CVS parking lot. I was just like. <laughs> We're going like three miles an hour. Oh. Like, oh. <laughs> I had an actual great moment of that uh, the other day. I was driving, and these people, these two Karen, like, Wait, are you leaving the AC on on purpose? Oh, shit. We forget about that. <laughs> Brought to you by AC Blasting. <laughs> if you didn't hear any of this. <laughs> you didn't hear any of this last Why one. Why louder when you turned it off? Uh, oh, shit. Did you turn it off? <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. We're on, boys. Um, well, that bad. part was probably lit. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay, but this is a scenario I had. I was drunk, dude. Look at him. I'm so <laughs> I got a little buzz We going. gotta start drinking more. I got a little buzz going. There's so much fun. I'm driving. There's these people standing outside. Driving. Their house. <laughs> Listen, I'm <laughs> driving. Um, and they're standing outside their house. They're like looking at everyone upset about something. And as I'm driving by, I hit them with like the, yeah. like the face they're making. And the, both of them are just like, uh, they give it back to me. They give I, it back to they you. They gave it back. That's savagery. Yeah. Is I, that why you bought the ski mask? You're feeling hella dangerous with it. You're. Are we going? <laughs> are we going back there after the episode? Huh? <laughs> Those people? Yeah. Well, actually, it's the same house. <laughs> this is the same house that when I. This is by my old house. I was driving someone home. Okay. And this house at night, the garage above it has this like flashing, like weird, like flickering light, and every time I drive past it and I see it. I have an intrusive thought. Oh, you've told me about this house. It's on the hill? Yeah, it's yeah. on the hill. I have this intrusive thought that the reason the light is flashing isn't because Someone's it's a malfunctioning light. I there. think someone's stuck in the attic. There's someone that is chained up up there, and the only thing they can do is flicker that light, and they're trying to tell people that they're stuck up there. <laughs> <laughs> That's your intrusive <laughs> Dude, we should go break into that house. I'm sure of it. Oh, I'm sure of it. I'm God. like, there's no way it flickers like this for this long for oh. any other reason than there's someone's trapped up there. We should and go. I think I I think we need to call the police. <laughs> we should go break in. I think we need to call oh. them. There's someone up there. I guarantee you, there's gonna be a news story. San Diego couple has child chained in multiple attic. people chained up in a garage. Yeah, guy. Had, and I'm gonna sit there and be like, damn, I could have saved them months ago. Oh. Who needs the police when you have a ski mask and the boys? Let's yeah. get in there. We Let's got go. two boys and a ski Let's mask. Climb that fucker. And, no, this is how you test it. We need a laser pointer. I'll tell you this. I'm invincible to cameras. Invisible? You are invincible to cameras. Invisible or invincible? Invincible. But what is he? Is it a red light or a regular light? No, it's like a like a garage light, like an outside light for like your driveway. Oh, so we just got to go with a flashlight and give him Morse code back and see if he responds. Maybe. That's definitely. Okay, so what are I you mean, thinking, wait, is, you it in, is it inside in the attic? No, it's outside. Okay. But so it's where the... It's you think where he's outside? The, you <laughs> could reach the electricity maybe. Like, like maybe they opened up a little we morse code a two it. by four. Like there's no way. I need to learn morse code. I need to learn morse code. Thank you. He knows morse code. Like there's no way they've let that care. Like imagine if you're inside trying to sleep and that's just blasting all night. Yeah. No, like, it's outside. 
That's what I'm saying. No, I'm saying that even if it's outside, it's outside your window. Okay, yeah, that's a good point. It's <laughs> probably not somebody stuck up there. Dude, no, just... <laughs> no, I'm, sa- I'm saying they would have fixed it. Okay, unless yeah. someone's triggering it. Dude, I just thought of how <laughs> fucked up it would be if I was stuck up in an attic and I was trying to act like I learned Morse code <laughs> or act like I knew Morse code up there. Just like, fuck, I don't know. You're just doing anything, <laughs> hoping somebody drive by notices uh, it, and you're the guy that's out there, and I'm just like, fuck, I'm <laughs> staying in here. I'm the only person that's driven by, and I'm like, I don't know Morse code. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, those are the things I hope you get a life replay on when you go to heaven or hell. It's like I, when you fucking thought you lost that thing so long ago, it was like fucking right there in some crazy place. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that would be fun. Or you should have just known Morse code and you would have saved a family. I could have yeah. saved a fucking entire fucking village of people. Village? <laughs> <laughs> a entire village. Oh, that's a fucking good question. What would you ask God when you fucking get up there? He knows everything. What would I ask God? Yeah. How'd you make No, it? not God. Let's just say somebody that knows everything. Okay. Because yeah, God's going to be like, I don't know if I don't like you that much. Um, what would I ask? Like if I could replay my life? Yeah. What would you want to see for sure? Like what was my highest potential if I would have like just gone for everything? <laughs> That's dark. Right? <laughs> That's dark. <laughs> oh, why don't you just shoot like, for everything? <laughs> well, no, I'm just saying like what if I could have been like... LeBron James? Yeah, I could have yeah. been the president. I'd like a replay of all my sexual deviance. Oh, just this. <laughs> I get it like an air, like an overhead. Overhead. How many deep. dudes could I have fucked? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> how many dudes did I think were trying to fuck me were actually trying to fuck me? That's a good one. That's a, how many dudes how tried many to, times was I How many dudes homophobic? wanted to fuck me? <laughs> how, many dudes, <laughs> how many dudes wanted to fuck me? How many dudes, if I was into them, yeah. could I have fucked? That's a better question. If I was gay or straight, which way would I have oh, gotten which way would I have a higher, Which would I have gotten laid yeah, more? How would I have gotten more ass? Ooh, would I have found more pure love if I was gay? That would fuck you Damn up. Damn, I'm hella gay this episode. I'm going to have margarita in fucking me, Fucking two beers were all like, I'm oh, so I'd f- ask if my boys were gay about <laughs> me. These things are two drinks per cocktail. Yeah. Yeah. And Morgan's had a couple glasses right, of wine. Had, yeah. A couple cocktails and were I like, had, yo, what if we were fucking gay? <laughs> <laughs> this is the gay zone. Uh, the dark gay zone. Yo, the, God, what if I was gay? Would I be happier? Yeah, and we turn on a blue light and everybody's like, fuck you. I felt like I got gypped down there. What if I was gay? Would it have been better? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's, that's good shit. What else you got, Piggy? Uh, let's see here. If you could pick one argument or like type of argument to always be right about, what would it be? Any argument with your girlfriend? <laughs> no, but there's there's specificity here. Well, that's a type of argument with with your girlfriend. There's a specific type no, of argument. No, that's that's too broad. Is it? I no, like, that's, it's that's, just called a dumb let argument. Just, <laughs> let, let me just say I like that answer. Oh, well, yeah, that's a clear answer. That's why it's too easy. Okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> Duh, of course, always right there. Who else are you fucking arguing with? No, it's, I'm saying winning any dumb argument, basically. I think, I yeah. think that's arguing what someone said. Like in the, oh, in the like, past would be a good one. Like no, having, I didn't say that. Having the record. Oh, show. okay. Yeah. Having the record show. Yeah, having the record having show. Having a stenographer. Yeah, like you down. said fucking blah, blah, blah. That's pretty good. Like, no, I didn't. I, yeah. I never said I was gay. What? <laughs> and then we pulled the podcast. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then we pulled this episode. I think, I think like being the, or saying the right way to do something. Oh, and then like someone thinking you're wrong, and then they find out you're yeah, right. Yeah, like oh, the like someone you're like oh, the best way to do it is actually this, and they're like nah. And then they they figure oh, out later. Yeah, that, and you're, I'm like I said that like an hour ago, and they're like no, you didn't. Yeah, yeah. See the saying it. It's a good one. Any or honestly, if you want specificity, anything that someone challenges you on, like aggressively, if they're like no, I know this. Oh, like facts. Yeah. If they were like absolutely not, no, this you're way wrong. You're those yeah. used to hit like way a- harder before phones. Do you remember like middle school arguments? Well, but here's they'd be a- like, dude, I swear to God, it's, I know this is true. It's like you might have seen it on like a fucking Discovery Channel show the day yeah. before. Wait, how and did people we- would be like, no, and then you'd be like, well, fucking have a teacher look it up. Yeah. Like you'd have no way of just pulling but, it up. But the thing about those is, is it wasn't necessarily who was right; it was who was able to argue it better. Yeah, yeah. charisma. They were you, more fun. Yeah, yeah. Wait, how did we get through middle school without that? Because we had the race. We, yeah, we, we would won just, every uh, argument. We would just uh, say, no, my dad told me. Yeah. <laughs> my dad told me that shit. Uh, well, not what you, else? What type of argument? There's so many good ones. Any, I mean, name an argument you want to be wrong in. Yeah. Well, no shit. But like, what would be the pinnacle to be best Like, at? if I was just always right about one A of one them? one of them? 
Political? No, I could give a fuck about. I think like a psychology based one. Statistics would be good. Statistics would be really good. Yeah. But those are also so stupid because like, yeah. oh, you memorize a stat. It would be really good to be good about like. It would well, be ninety nine percent of the time. I'm wrong. <laughs> <laughs> I oh, think so you would like to be right. I'd like that. to be right when I'm because shooting out like random statistics. Fucking statistic. are, yeah. Yeah, when I shoot out fucking a two thousand four thing. So the answer That's is true. anything. Yeah, <laughs> whatever I say, it's like fucking. I think one out of three people is gay or something. Something like psychology to where like <laughs> you could be, you could say something like the reason you think that is because this. Oh, but if you can mansplain. Them. Yeah. <laughs> but also that's so objective as well or subjective. Well, but if I'm always right, no one's going to ever yeah. check me. That's he's true. Right. Yeah. He's right. True. If you're right, you're right. You're right. Like five times in a row, I'm right. Like someone's like, fuck you. I'm going to Google it. They're going to stop right. They're going to stop. Yeah. Fact and then I'm yeah. just like, ah. So basically the question is, what would you like to know? <laughs> <laughs> what would you uh, like to oh what would anything you like about, to actually know? know anything about your fucking mom i would love to know for sure like my any, mom yeah anything anyone's mom <laughs> like i'm just we have an, an argument i'm like your fucking mom <laughs> <laughs> uh, mom jokes are always 100 yeah, percent great yeah. your you, mom sucks 1500 dicks you call, <laughs> you call her and ask her and she's like yes honey yeah, <laughs> yeah. If I'm right about your mom all the time, that's Fuck, yeah. that would suck every time. <laughs> that's a rebuttal to any argument yeah. of all time. Yeah, you win everything right you, there. You, that's it. That's it. That's you, it. The first three times you call her up and ask her, she's like, yeah, how'd you know that? Like, oh, man. Yeah, that would hit. And then eventually it just gets to the yeah. point where Morgan's just throwing out the most absurd facts about yeah. your mom. And you're yeah. just like, stop. You're like, <laughs> mom, <laughs> mom, in 76, did you suck a dick in the back of a yeah. fucking like Denny's parking lot? And she's like... <laughs> <laughs> you're like you're like I'm never arguing with Morgan ever. My again. mom would never do that. <laughs> oh yeah, call her. Yep. Um, never starting an argument with Morgan. Professor's dick for a fucking C minus. Morgan gets away with the most <laughs> chess arguments of all time because we're scared to rebuttal him. Oh, you'd be, you'd never fuck up an argument. No, with the, me ever the best part about that is you are right about every kind of like sub like the one subject. Mm. You could start lying. Yeah. And no one would check you after a certain point. Like if you got enough in a row right. Mm -hmm. You could just be like, fuck it. Like, yeah, it'd be so hard to talk to you ever. Yeah. Like if I had to call my mom five times in a row and she admitted <laughs> to everything on the sixth time, you're like, yeah, your mom fucked Neil Armstrong on the, on the moon. You'd be like, fuck yeah. <laughs> I get to a point where it's like, I know you're right. I just can't hear my mom say it anymore. Yeah, I don't want to call her. I don't want to hear it. I can't call her. I'm anymore. about to fuck your mom later tonight. And you're like, <laughs> Yo. And you're just like. <laughs> Mom, I'm not calling her. I'm not calling her. <laughs> but I'm still right. And we're in a group of people and they're yeah. like, call her. <laughs> <laughs> Shows you the Southwest uh, flight confirmation. <laughs> holy fuck. That was a good one. Fuck. I think wait, how much we had on that? One An hour or seven. I think we saved these. But we had a good we had a good like 10, 15 minutes in between. No, I mean I, I think, still got I fucking was gas. Like five, <laughs> give us one more. One more gas. Um Yeah, I got a little bit more drink. I got three more. <laughs> okay. How many times do you think your dad thought about asking to abort you? <laughs> thought of. Okay. So to answer this question truthfully, <sighs> my parents told me <laughs> that I was an accident. <laughs> And okay. because I was an accident, I know there's no way that my dad hadn't asked at least triple digit. <laughs> <laughs> triple digit? Double there's digit. There's no way. Okay. Double digit. I had a scenario of this type and I asked quadruple digit. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Um, I think triple digits not even that early because you at least ask you once ask a day, five times a day for at least the first couple weeks before it gets like too far. Mm -hmm. You ask five times a day. I'm not, it's not, it, a, you it's not, I, a, it's not a direct ask. You're not like, Hey, are we not going to have them? You're just like, Hey, so what do you think? Of it? <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you walk in the room like every five minutes just sweating bullets. It's like, like so you just walk in there and you're like, dude, diapers are seventy two dollars a fucking pack yeah. right now. Did you have some more time to think about it? Sweetie? Yeah, you whip up a whole spreadsheet of all the fucking expenses. Yeah. I'd say confidently my parents didn't want me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Um, okay, so I know for a... My dad just said this nonchalant as fuck. Okay. He was like, I'm surprised that you... <laughs> <laughs> Oh, ready. good. Ready. By the by, the grace of God, you don't have like four or five other siblings or something. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were going to say, I'm surprised you made it. <laughs> no, it was another one. We tried. 
<laughs> we tried to take your ass out we, multiple times. We sent the fucking nuke. Uh, in. We sent the cavalry after you. We tried to shove Accutane up there. Fucking <laughs> like I kicked not, her down the stairs. Of <laughs> we sent the cavalry in there, dude. How Holy are you up, shit. kid? How are you? Fucking up? gut punches don't work anymore. By the <laughs> grace. <laughs> Your mom's a warrior. <laughs> no, but he said some shit like there were like six or seven <laughs> others, and I was like, what, what did you just is? say, bro? I'm still your child. Six or seven <laughs> others? <laughs> Holy oh, shit. shit. It's the hot and okay, sweaty okay. episode. To go on a, like, a nicer note. Yeah, right. There's no way my dad's first thought wasn't, let's not keep it. Yes. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's why it, it was thought. Like, like like she brought it. Oh, I'm pregnant. And his first thought was like, want to be? <laughs> Are you sure? You wanna be? <laughs> and well, then she was like, yes. And he was like, absolutely. Of course. Yeah. I just want to yeah. make sure you wanted it. No, I was testing you. Yeah. <laughs> I definitely want him. I don't know why I just thought. We'll was. have the nurse name him. <laughs> but I just thought of myself <laughs> asking that question and then just cutting back to you screaming with the fucking skin mask. <laughs> That's the clip right there. <laughs> it's just like oh. how many times do you think oh <laughs> it's <just> over <laughs> uh, well that, that one got dark <laughs> yeah that's a good that's, that's a good uh yeah it might be a good closer to a fucking <laughs> heater it's yeah the, the lights are for fucking spooky season dude and we're switching lights the are good yeah I'm gonna get these every time. Yeah, those we are gotta start boozing. We're each again. getting our own individual four yeah, pack. We gotta start boozing way harder. I'm more often. The, I'm gonna get these for us. <laughs> I tried to get the Thunder These roll. are only 10 yeah. for four? For four. And they're yeah. double. They're doubles. We need to start drinking so five. a lot more <laughs> <laughs> often. Okay. Let's do let's do this. We have we have a couple things set up that we need to do. Okay. <laughs> burp, burp. It's all burp. Um first one, drink. We're gonna do spooky season. Yeah. Second one. Let's get absolutely fucking shit hammered. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we have this. We're in a garage now for those people. I can't home. tell. Soundproof. We're in a studio. It's soundproof. We're, in, we're a not in a garage. Yeah, I'm sorry. Okay, let me cut this. We're in a studio now for the people. Yeah, we have a that. sick ass studio. <laughs> Super expensive studio. You can see the garage door light behind <laughs> Oh, we gotta cover that up. No, but we made some. Wait, Jay, we have a spot for the no FOMO sign now. That's what I'm saying. Right on the wall no, right there. I'll cut it out. <laughs> No, I'm saying it doesn't need to block it. We have a spot to actually mount yeah, it right behind him. Oh, true. But yeah, we have a fucking. It's getting there. We have a garage. Yeah, we we're have a setting it together. We have a setup with fucking hella screens and shit and lights and shit, Dude, <laughs> mics and shit. All right, for every Wednesday in October, we're getting fucking shit. Let's get fucking belligerent. We're That's gonna get. Sa- okay, we gotta get back Thank to the roots. This is bullshit. <laughs> and that was episode <laughs> sixty. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>